Yo, what's up, you guys? It's your boy Reset here, and you know, doing a tutorial here today. And a couple people asked me to do some, so I thought I would. All right, so let's get into this. Go ahead and upload a clip or import a clip here. And do that. I'm just do this one. All right, and what I'm gonna do here today is a color correction tutorial. So. Yeah, a lot of people like my color creations, and so why not? I'm just gonna get to like right here or something. All right, so what you want to do is just go ahead and uh, duplicate this layer. I'll name it. All right, you just want to press Control D, and then uh, what am I looking for? Come over here to your effects and presets. Type in threshold. And drag it on. You just want to get to the amount you're comfortable with, mostly the sky. So I'm going to go with like 230. Yeah, that looks good. Alright, so 230. It's different for every map, so just keep that in mind. Just type that CC. And what do I want to do now? I'm going to get the um, fast blur. Then you want to drag on the fast blur. So get that and drag it on. Up this to about a thousand. I'm just typing it in be easy. Thousand. And just click repeat edge pixels. And then I think. Um, okay, yeah. Now you just want to come over here and type in color gradient. And drag that on. And then somebody's calling my phone. Let me just click it. Or my laser. Okay, so you just want to change these colors here to whatever you prefer. I'm just gonna go with like a red and go with like a orange down there. I'm gonna up these all the way up here somewhere. Okay, that way you get them like yeah. You just want to change this here to overlay. I'm gonna get something like that. Click add, and now you get that, and it looks nice so far. But you see how it's like sometimes it's like not in good areas. So what you want to do is just up the threshold some. So let's go back up here to the threshold. And, I mean not up it, but go down a little bit. So well, let's do like two ten or something. Now let's see how that looks. Yeah, it looks a lot better. But I'm gonna show y'all. You can add a couple more things here too, which is what I'm gonna do. Actually, no. Let's make it to oh, no, let's do two hundred. Okay, yeah, two hundred. Two hundred looks good. All right. Now you just wanna go ahead and press Control D and duplicate that. And set what you wanna do is delete all of those. All right. So now you just have this. Now let's change that back to normal for now. Mm -hmm. I want to get a threshold. Sorry, my throat's kind of messed up right now. Mm -hmm. I want to get a threshold. Drag it on, you know, make it about the sky. For this one, let's do 220. Yeah, 220. You want to get a fast blur. Or no, not not fast blur. CC radio fast blur. Not bad, not bad. You just want to up that to 100, leave it at standard, zoom out some, and you just want to up it like I'm going to do it um, over here, but I'm going to lower the threshold. I mean, up it. Yeah. Let's do about 235. Yep, that looks good. So, 235. And now, what do I add? Uh, let's see. I was this to uh, light rays. This is optional, by the way. You guys don't have to do this. Okay, yeah, you want to add a hue saturation. That's what it is. And you just want to click colorize, and you can change it to whatever color you would like. For this one, I'm just going to do like blue or whatever. You don't have to do that. You can just leave it white if you wanted to. 
you can get these like flares coming in. But I like to colorize it and use it a lot better. Uh, still like right here. Mm -hmm. Oh no, people's blowing up my phone. Like, get off my phone, please. Alright. So, yeah, that's about it for this tutorial, really. And that's how you make a pretty sick color correction. So, on the next one, I'll see you guys later. Peace.